So, I just want to talk about the butterflies and the bees. Where are they? Normally, that Budlia bush would have so many different um, butterflies and bees throughout the day, especially when the sun's out. Loads of them, in fact, but now there's just, there really isn't any. I think I've probably seen about two butterflies this year in my garden. What's it all about? What's going on? I've got a good idea what it's all about. And I was online and I saw um, on Facebook somebody put a post up and this was quite alarming actually because this goes back to 2015. But take a look at this. So a scientific study found high amounts of aluminium contamination in bees at levels that would cause brain damage to humans. Now if this is happening to um, bees, it has to be happening to butterflies. Bees suffer dementia due to, due to the aluminium pollution. Aluminium, the new factor in the decline of the bee populations. You know, this is horrendous really. Where's the aluminium coming from if it isn't above? Even Jeremy Clarkson has put a tweet out saying he's alarmed how very few butterflies there are when he's walking around his um, farm so come on we've got to wake up so there you have it let me know what you think in the comments because it's quite scary isn't it you know we're used to we get the odd flies in fact we get loads of flies because well I hate flies but the butterflies the bees we haven't even really seen many wasps this year now is it because of the aluminium or is it because the weather hasn't been warm enough for these insects to thrive? I don't know, but it's quite a scary thought because we need those insects to pollinate and to bring us food. So let me know what you think in the comments, but I hope you're all well. And yeah, do everything you can to try and encourage wildlife into your garden with wildflowers and stuff, not farms rewilding. Although I can understand why that could be quite an issue at the moment, especially with the lack of butterflies and things, but no. Just see what you can do to bring the wildlife into your garden. And, but like I said, I think a lot of it is down to... But there, look after yourselves, take care, and I'll speak to you all again soon. Bye for now.